Hello everybody. So in this video I will demonstrate my first prototype of uh, dry cell hydrogen generator. So to make my own uh, hydrogen generator I was inspired by uh, some YouTuber. Uh, the name of this YouTuber is Alex Lab and this guy is from Russia and he makes a lot of different uh, hydrogen generators and with these hydrogen generators also makes really really cool stuff so right now this hydro uh, hydrogen generator is filled with the electrolyte the electrolyte which i use is some water and potassium hydroxide so the concentration of potassium hydroxide is 15 percent uh, and the electrodes which i use in this system are made from stainless steel so some stainless steel plates like this one uh, this stainless steel electrode uh, have the dimension of four centimeters by eight centimeters and the thickness is two millimeters uh, and between each stainless steel electrode i use this rubber so this rubber have the thickness of three millimeters and uh, this rubber is in basic some neoprene uh, rubber and will seal everything really really nice so the setup of each electrode is like so in the end of this video i will also uh, show you how i make everything um, so basic this hydrogen generator is not the best uh, but it's also not bad so the system also have some pump this pump i buy on ebay uh, it's not very expensive and operates on around three volts something like this uh, and it's really really nice so right now on this system i don't have any pump uh, because i feel uh, the generator with the electrolyte and I will try to run this generator without uh, without electrolyte flow so the voltage which I use will be 12 volts uh, and let's see the hydrogen production so this is my bubbler and I will start Three, two, one. See also the balloon. Right now the system takes around 12 volts and around 4 amps. Not bad for the first try. So right now I will disconnect. Okay. Uh. Oh.
And let's go outside. Real nice. <laughs> oh. Okay. Uh, this was a really big boom. And yeah, the people are sleeping because uh, right now is at night <laughs> and yeah, <laughs> I test my hydrogen balloon. So here I have all the parts, but I need to make some uh, dried cell hydrogen generator. Uh, so here is my uh, 3 to 4 volt pump. Here I have dent plates. These two plates are some acrylic. I also think to make the end plates from uh, ABS plastic, but my ABS plastic is a little bit thicker and uh, it's hard to work with this plastic. So here I have some acrylic, one centimeter acrylic uh, plates. These two plates will hold everything together. Uh, my electrodes, I have here six electrodes made from stainless steel. And, and in basic, all electrodes uh, are made on the same way. So here I have some hole for uh, the gas. Here I have the hole for the electrolyte and this hole is for connection. I also have this rubber. Uh, this rubber uh, I also buy on uh, eBay and in basic this one is some uh, neoprene rubber and bunch of screws and for the end plates which I use some acrylic plates. I have one hole. This hole is uh, for the output of the hydrogen. And this hole is for the electrolyte. On this pipe, I will connect uh, my pump. And here I also need to make some hole for the electrolyte out that the entire electrolyte can circle but uh, i will wait a little bit with this hole because i will try to make uh, the first setup with no electrolyte flow
so here I have my generator uh, here I have right now only water and into this water I soak this pump and let's see two volts three volts Okay, so for the pump, the two volts will be enough. And any leakage? No. So guys, and for the end, here is my, uh, a little bit improved version of my hydrogen generator. Uh, the entire design of this generator is the same uh, but I upgrade uh, the inner layers uh, a little bit of this generator and that way I get a little bit better production of the hydrogen so now you see uh, this production of the hydrogen in this bubbler and yeah the creation of the hydrogen is a little bit improved so for a little upgrades on this uh, hydrogen generator will be videos on my patreon but for the finish of this video i have here a little bit bigger balloon that i use previous and yeah actually i will try to explode this one okay Okay, this one is ready and let's go outside. So guys, that's it. We'll see us in the next video and bye.